Welcome back to another video. I'm out here with my boy Captain Dave. Tell us a little bit what we're doing today. So today we are out here in the Indian River Lagoon. We uh, are after my specialty fish today. Um, it's called a triple tail. I've uh, been fishing for these for about eight years now and um, got them down pretty pretty good. So we're gonna try to put these boys on some fish today. See if we can't get a few. There he is. Nope. Yep, that's that's the baby one. Dang. <laughs> Did you really? Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, it watches gills. Oh shoot! <laughs> Freaking salt. He was ahead of me. Right? 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 I'm looking at wrong already. What are you talking about? Before the brain. You see that thing? What's the thing you see for here? to get in the motor. All right, slowly. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. When I put the net in, I can't net him. You have to bring him into the net. Otherwise, he'll just run. Oh my God. I am like... <sighs> <laughs> That jig doesn't bend. Nah, you got you got good enough drag. Are you ready? Nope. He's not. <laughs> He's on that boat again. Yeah. Bring him. Bring his head up out of the water, and then you'll have to slide him over here because I won't be able to net him. He won't. He's not gonna. Lie. <laughs> Work. 
working them. Dude, do they ever get tired? <laughs> My gosh. <laughs> I'm trying to not horse them in. Alright, bring his head up if you can. Hold on. I don't have a lot of faith on this jig. Alright, you ready? Yes, sir! Oh my gosh! That's a stud! Look at that thing. Alright, look at that big boy. Big old triple tail. Dang, that's crazy, dude. Thanks, Captain Dave. All right guys, the cold front started to come in and we got rained on pretty hard. So we decided to call a day and drive back to the house to cook up the stud triple tail. Honestly, not bad for my first one. It weighed about eight pounds or so. Measured um, 22 inches, I'm pretty sure. It was a great fight on light tackle. I caught it on my Daiwa BG 3000 on my black fan medium rod. Um, I'm gonna roll the cleaning clips now and hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video. Normally I would not fillet a fish alive. And so just because we didn't have any ice, that's why. Because they're a little bit harder to fillet. He's so hard to fillet alive. So I usually grab him right there. There's like a piece of his meat that goes away right here. So I'll grab it right there and then I'll go down this red line. And then you can hold that meat right there. And you can finish cutting it right there and then come straight down his red line again. Run that, run that knife right down that, that bone. Backbone, you usually get it right there at that backbone and then poke it through. Run it down there. Take it to his rib cage. Do the same thing on this. You'll find that, you'll find this piece of meat right there. See where it separates? Grab that piece of meat right there. Break it down. I'll do the same thing, come down his ribcage. So hard to fillet a fish alive. This is my specific cheek knife right here. Cheeks only. Oh, you take cheek meat out too? Oh yeah. Cut it right there to break it. As soon as he gets all the way through, it'll just peel right off. Look at that. Dang. Medallion. Always heard of grouper medallions, not, not triple tail medallions. Mm-hmm. Same thing, peel it right off. <laughs> Alright, he's done. Yep. Yeah. So what, what I usually do is I angle my knife there, I cut it on the tail enough for me to grab. And I grab it, I hold that knife down to the bottom, 
and then I pull the skin and leave the knife stationary. And you'll have to take this little piece. My dad always calls this the ribbon, but this little piece right there is no good. Take that off. Let me clean this up a little bit here. Same thing with the other side. I usually get it right there, start it up just enough until I can grab it, pull that skin. And then a little ribbon piece. Yep, little ribbon piece right there. Take that little ribbon out, cut these pin bones out. There'll be a row of pin bones right there. Hear it? Mm. It'll run about right there. You'll be able to feel it. Take it, run my knife down there, cut a V out so it takes those out. Check around the rib cage right here. If you don't feel any, I think there's a piece right there. I'll go ahead and cut this little piece out then. Take this little piece out right there. Good to go. Good fillet. Clean triple toe fillet. Look at that. Same thing on this side. You'll hear it. Actually, you can see the bone right there. You can, you'll be able to hear them. They'll run down this whole little area right here. Hit it. Run down this little piece right there. Good to go. Look at that. This is my favorite piece right here. This one. That piece right there. This one? No, that one. Oh. <laughs> right there. That's the tail piece. Because you know why? That fits perfect on a perfect sandwich right there. Fried <laughs> <laughs> Perfect fish sandwich. So when you eat as much fish as I do, you got to get the 20 ounce batch of <laughs> black and seasoning. <laughs> All right, so we're going to take one whole fillet right there and right there. I usually dry it off, but we're not today. I like it a lot. I'm a seasoned guy, too. Yeah, me too. Mm. Coated. All right. A little bit of oil. Pop these bad boys right here. Let her cook. There's <laughs> one. Look at that, black and triple tail. All right guys, thanks for watching the video today. Appreciate Captain Dave out here taking me out and uh, letting me catch the biggest triple tail of my life. Hopefully we catch bigger uh, later on. We will, we'll get out there. Yeah. We had some tough conditions today. The tide wasn't rolling right. We had a bad cold front moving in, so it was a little tough conditions, but we were able to catch a few of them, so. Yeah, we brought them over, cooked them up, tastes amazing. I favorite fish now other than snug <laughs> <laughs> and they're good. yeah they're pretty good they're we good. gotta go out there and uh catch more again but um if you guys enjoy this video make sure to leave a like down below subscribe if you're new and i'll see you guys on the next one oh double dog oh you got the big one